Hi, I'm Cindy Santa Anna, Integrative Nutritionist for the Amen Clinics and your Wellness Wednesday host. Today's topic is omega-3 fatty acids. One of the myriad lab tests that we run here is the omega fatty acid index to test for omega-3, 6, and 9 ratios. Omega-3 fatty acids help keep your brain sharp, maintain a healthy weight, and support a robust immune system. As a holistic nutritionist, I constantly see how vital these special fats are to my client's health. But research shows that up to 90% of Americans are deficient in omega-3 fatty acids. Essential omega-3 fatty acids are those which you must get from your diet. The only essential omega-3 is alpha-linoleic acid, or ALA. ALA is found in plant foods like walnuts and flax seeds, but that doesn't mean that ALA is the only important omega-3 fatty acid. Long-chain omega-3s are just as, if not more, important. We have EPA and DHA that are most well-known and studied. The benefits of long-chain omega-3 fatty acids include support for depression, EPA was shown in one study to be just as effective as prescription antidepressants. Vision, DHA, is crucial for eyesight with low levels associated with rates of age-related vision loss and support for hot flashes. In a clinical trial, EPA supplements decrease the frequency and, and intensity of menopausal hot flashes compared to the placebo, and then heart health. In a 2018 study, they found that high doses of EPA significantly reduced the risk of heart attacks. And for blood clots, research has shown that DPA helps prevent dangerous blood clots. The definition of an essential nutrient is one that we must get from our diet. The body can't produce it on its own. And technically, if you're consuming ALA, your body can convert it. However, your body can only convert about 2 to 9% of that ALA into usable DHA and EPA. So, and research has shown that even some converg conversion rates are as low as zero for DHA. That means you need to eat an absurd amount of walnuts and flax seeds to get to the 250 milligrams per day recommended. So eating fat, fatty cold water fish like salmon and halibut, I love sardines and anchovies as well, is really important to maintain those good high levels. But if you're allergic or you don't like fish or maybe you're vegan, a really good high quality fish oil supplement or a vegan supplement is really important so that you can get those levels of those high omega-3 fatty acids to get all those benefits. Take care. Mm -hmm.